Parkland Health Center is one of many small community hospitals who are partners in Barnes Jewish Hospital and Washington University Medical School's acute stroke network. We're one of the largest hospitals from Festus to Cape Girardeau, Missouri. So we serve many very rural counties. We have 100 beds. We take care of any emergency that comes to our door, of course. However, sometimes you need that specialist. And when that specialist is needed, doctors here used to reach for the phone to contact Barnes Jewish Hospital. But now a new tool is helping them bring that expertise right to a patient's bedside. It's a robot that includes a camera, microphone, and television screen to provide instant video conferencing. Will make a huge difference, I believe, in the quality of life for patients. What it, what it really does is kind of expands our ability to provide care to centers remotely. So this is using telemedicine um, technology, which is a video, two-way video between the patient's bedside and the, and the practitioner. It's one of the latest ways technology is bringing the expertise of Barnes Jewish Hospital and Washington University physicians to patients outside the immediate St. Louis area. It is one of the unique things here that we have neurology, neurosurgery, um, interventional neuroradiology, um, all kind of under one roof, with um, all with expertise and all available 24 hours a day, seven days a week. It will allow us to bring more expert care to the bedside in a more timely manner. And obviously with stroke patients, uh, time is of the essence. Doctors say when it comes to stroke patients, time is brain. Important clot-busting medicines that can only be administered within hours of a stroke can often mean the difference in a patient's survival and quality of life following a stroke. But only some patients qualify, and some may need more care than a community hospital can provide. When we see a patient with focal neurological deficit, being an hour away from St. Louis, 20 minutes by air, an hour by ground, that decision becomes very critical because there's a very critical time window in which that needs to be given. If we can talk to a neurologist and get their input right away, they can just add to the accuracy of that decision and add to the patient safety factor as well. Doctors with the Barnes Jewish Hospital Acute Stroke Network say this type of technology has been used by the military for years. They say being able to see and interact with patients, whether the illness is stroke, trauma, or cardiac care, helps improve outcomes. Networks uh, really imply kind of a pre-thought, well-designed um, um, pattern of care for these patients. To make sure that the patients that are receiving um, that are receiving care through this novel technology are effectively receiving the same care as if they'd rolled into our own emergency room.